everyone and welcome to Pixie Studios and today we are going to be doing another hairstyle video. We're going to be showing you how to make the perfect American Girl ponytail and some tips and tricks on how to make it look kind of like they do at the store when you get a hairstyle done. So I'm super excited for this video and I hope you enjoy so let's get started. The first thing you're going to want to do is to spray the top of your doll's hair just slightly, like not so it's soaked, but so it definitely gets a little bit wet. And then we're going to brush out her hair. You can spray the bottom part as well if it's easier for you to brush it. Now we are going to be showing you a low ponytail on Molly, and then we're going to be doing a higher ponytail on Grace and then we're going to do a one with shorter hair so we're going to do a low ponytail on Annie. So for Molly's we're going to bring the hair back into a ponytail and then try to make it look really really straight and sleek. I always try to do it above the ears. Once you have all of the hair above the ears then we are going to use a brush to smooth all of the hair back. If her hair has dried out a little bit already, then you can always spray it a little bit more and it will also do a great job of keeping the flyaways nicely in the ponytail. Once you have the ponytail basically ready, then it is time to take a hair elastic and tie it off. Try to get it as close to the middle as you can because that is what makes it a really good ponytail. Once you have the ponytail all tied off, then we're going to work on the ponytail a little bit and get it looking nice and curly and fluffy. So I'm just going to kind of brush it out again because it got a little bit tangly with all the brushing of the top part of the hair. and. You can do little curls if you want, but I found that it looks a lot nicer if you just bring it into one big curl. So in order to do that, you just twist it, and then you can add a little water if you would like to make it a little bit more curly. Alright, so we're going to have Molly spin around here, and you can look at the finished ponytail. Now we are on to Grace and we are going to be doing a high ponytail on her and these have a lot of the same instructions except there are a couple of few tips that I have learned when doing high ponytails on Grace specifically so I will share those with you. So with Grace, she always had that um, braid that went right here and I took it out a while ago. It still is a little bit wavy and such and I don't really like the look of having it coming in front. It kind of cuts off the bangs a little bit and I like to always pull this back because I think it makes her bangs look cuter and just her face. So with her I always love to when doing a high ponytail pull this top hair straight back. And so spray your hair like Molly's and brush it out and then just grab it into a sloppy high ponytail and then we will make it more straight. Like I said, we are going to be brushing this top hair forward or back so that we can have a nice look on the high ponytail. And basically the main key to these ponytails is keeping it very nice and tight while brushing the hair back with a brush. Once you are satisfied with the ponytail, then you can tie it off with an elastic. So here is the back of Grace's ponytail and what I usually do is just comb it out with the brush so it looks really wide and um, thick and fluffy so then it looks really cool with straight hair to kind of puff it up a little bit. And here is the spin. So now we are on to Miss Annie and she has medium length hair that just is able to reach into a ponytail with all the little short ones underneath. So hers is a little bit more difficult to do, but it is really cute once you get it in a ponytail 
and so I definitely recommend trying to do it with them because it looks really cute. So just spray it again and spraying is really the trick to getting the perfect ponytail because it looks so wet, you know, when it's wet and it, can, it behaves really well when trying to get into a ponytail, then gather it into a ponytail, make sure you bring it above the ears like the other ones on both sides and make sure you brush it around to try to avoid these bumpy things in the back. So brush it out really nice above the ears and you should end up with a really cute little ponytail. One of the other main things to try to avoid is don't pull their hair back like this over the top of the part when you're doing a low ponytail. Try your best to just bring it around the sides and then grab it together in the back because that is the way that it looks cutest and that is a way you can avoid bumps. Here is Annie's finished ponytail and because her hair is so short it kind of just sticks out like that but I kind of like it. It looks pretty cute on her and her hair is so shiny so it a ponytail really brings out her shiny hair. Yay! Here are the ponytails and I think they turned out pretty cute. If you enjoyed please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And be sure to let me know which one was your favorite in the comments below. I would have to pick Molly's as my favorite. But be sure to let me know which one is your favorite. And I will see you in the next video. Thanks so much for watching. Bye!